It's a Minimalist Monday edition of Optimal Finance Daily, episode 191, No Credit Cards No Matter What, by Courtney Carver of BeMoreWithLess.com. And I am your host and narrator, Dan. This is where I read to you from some of the best personal finance blogs on the planet. Now, the title of today's article is No Credit Cards No Matter What. But before you start yelling at your podcast players saying that credit cards are good for the rewards and building credit, I'll say that this is really more about the holidays and Black Friday, the crazy shopping spree that always happens after Thanksgiving here in the United States. Now, if you're good at paying your credit cards off every month and don't have long-term credit card debt, you could be taking advantage of anywhere from 1% to 5% off your everyday purchases. I know that Justin from Optimal Living Daily has made well over $1,000 from credit card rewards in just the last few years. He tracks that kind of stuff. So if you're careful and if you avoid any fees and interest, it could definitely work for you. And with that, let's hear the post and start optimizing your life. No Credit Cards, No Matter What by Courtney Carver of BeMoreWithLess.com Welcome to Black Friday and to the kickoff of the season of more where stores open early, stay open all night, and offer you incentives to come and charge the holidays away. Buy one, get one free offers, call your name. Your kids shared their wish lists and if they were good all year, why not shower them with gifts for the next month? Between TV ads, catalogs in the mail, internet pop-ups, and talk on Facebook about the latest and greatest, maybe your kids forgot what makes them smile, and maybe you did too. The time is now. This might be your only chance to land the perfect gift and take advantage of a deal of a lifetime. The holidays only come once a year, so why not splurge? You know you want to, and you too have been good all year. Why not pull that credit card out that you save for emergencies for this special occasion? Well, here's why. Christmas is not an emergency. No one will remember what kind of wrapping paper you used. More presents under the tree does not make a more memorable holiday. You don't want to pay for Christmas 2010 all year long in 2011. It feels good to opt out of the Yankee Swap, Pink Elephant, or other crazy gift exchanges. The gift of an emergency fund will make you smile longer than something shiny and new. A BYOB party is just as much fun as an open bar if you invite people you love and volunteering at a homeless shelter will fill you up more deeply than dinner out with overpriced holiday entrees. During the holidays, you are compelled to spend more on food, decor, entertainment, gifts, dining out, party planning, traveling, and more. By the end of December, you're fat, tired, and broke. By the beginning of January, you resolve to be thin, energetic, and wealthy. See the problem? The solution is simple. Stop the madness and simplify. No credit cards, no matter what. By using cash, you will likely spend less, eat less, and do less. Don't worry, you will still do more than usual and you will still indulge, but maybe with a little less spending, the holidays will mean even more. I think you're ready. When I posted this on Twitter, keep the holidays simple, no credit cards, no matter what. Are you with me? Here's what you had to say. Absolutely. Cash only, this could be hard. I'm with you, I don't even have one. Already there. I don't like debt at all, and the holidays are no exception. Heck yeah. I already stopped using my credit card. Well, except for car rentals sometimes. Yes, this is the second Christmas in a row with no credit cards. I'm in. Are you kidding? We're all homemade this year. I am so with you. If you are still thinking about using credit cards because you think you won't have enough tinsel on the tree or enough food to offer visitors or enough big gifts to give away, Let me remind you, you have enough. You are enough. Spending less might mean that you get to participate more fully in the season. The real meaning of Christmas or whatever December holiday you celebrate is not in your wallet, a beautifully wrapped box or inside a cookie. You know what it is, but maybe you've been too stressed and tired to experience it. Maybe it's time to try something new. You just listened to the post titled No Credit Cards No Matter What by Courtney Carver of BeMoreWithLess.com. And as I mentioned at the top of the show, Justin tracks his credit card rewards. He also tracks every expense and income, all the pennies in and out of his life. And he's been doing that since 2010. And you can get the Excel spreadsheet that he uses and you can try it for yourself. Just doing it for a week can bring a lot of mindfulness and awareness to your purchases. So to get that spreadsheet and a lot of other tools for free to help you optimize your finances, come by oldpodcast.com and enter your email address. That will add you into our weekly newsletter group. 
You'll get those gifts I mentioned, plus you'll be entered to win books each and every month. Again, you can enter your email address at oldpodcast.com or you can just text in, uh, just text the word financial to the number 44222. And that's it for today's episode. Tomorrow, we're going to be hearing from Kaylin Bruce on a very similar topic, talking about the case for cash versus the case for credit cards. So stay tuned for that tomorrow where your optimal life awaits. Hello, Life Optimizer. This is Justin Mollick, creator and producer of this podcast, but also Optimal Living Daily, the show where I read to you from even more blogs covering finance, productivity, minimalism, personal development, and more from incredible bloggers like Derek Sivers, Zen Habits, Mark and Angel, The Minimalists, and all the ones you hear on this show too. So if you enjoyed today's episode and like taking amazing blogs on the go, come on over to Optimal Living Daily and subscribe to that one too. And together, we'll start optimizing your life. You've been listening to Optimal Finance Daily. Be sure to hit the subscribe button to stay up to date on each new episode and head to oldpodcast.com. That's oldpodcast.com for a free gift as well as more actionable tips and resources to help you maximize your potential. Thanks for joining us. And remember, your optimal life awaits.